Until yesterday, he could have gone for 22, 23 million euros. He had a clause in his contract that allowed him to do that. And if anybody came with that offer, Valencia were forced to either give him 700,000 euros raising his wages a year or sell him. So that was the situation. Arsenal, uh, in my belief, basically just wanted to pay that, that money, needed to have it, maybe from the sales deal. But uh, although Juan Mata expected that offer to arrive yesterday, and Valencia also expected a call from Arsenal, final as the deal basically just didn't happen. So what happened now is that his new contract that uh, automatically uh, has, has been renewed, basically, it means that his clause by a cost will be 60 million euros. So that's, it seems, the end of the saga, of the Juan Mata saga for, for Arsenal. There were calls made from Spurs in the last few hours to see if uh, the player could go, but uh, basically uh, the player wanted to go to either Barcelona or Arsenal, or as it happened, stayed. 60 million euros is his buy of course. That, that you can negotiate with Valencia. Remember, they've got a debt, some people say, over 500 million euros. So if anybody came with 30 plus million euros, Valencia would be willing to sell. They've been willing to sell all summer. But I just don't see anybody doing that. Say if uh, eventually uh, Cesc Fabregas goes to Barcelona and around 35 to 40 million euros arrive to Arsenal, will they be willing to spend most of it on Juan Mata? I, I just don't think so. The opportunity was there. Uh, Juan Mata was willing to go to Arsenal. Valencia, happy to sell him to Arsenal, but the money never came.